Well, phase two already underway with restaurants reopening their indoor dining, nail and hair salons and barber shops can also reopen. And as our Hunter signs found out, things will be quite different if you get out this weekend and you can expect some long waits as well. Well, it didn't take long for some businesses to reopen under phase two and customers were ready. Well, it's good to have our customers back. A taste of normalcy with a side of rules. This is just trying to get a few dollars running through the checking account and bring some people back to work. It's the new norm at Gin Mill, a favorite nightlife bar in South End, but also a restaurant. It opened its doors at 5 p.m. sharp Friday evening under phase two. Owner John Ellison says several health precautions are underway. You can see all the signage that we have in here. All the tables are spaced at least six feet apart. Servers are wearing masks as well as some patrons, but not all. Markers outside keep those waiting spread out. We're really having to change the way we do things. Salons and barbers, including two of Stephanie Parker's supercuts, will open up Saturday under phase two. We needed to go to appointment only, which is not the way our business has ever functioned before. These chairs have been empty for nine weeks as her staff safely planned a healthy return to work. Face masks, stylists have to wear them, customers are required to wear them. Hand sanitizer is at the ready. Every other chair will be used, and there is no waiting for a cut inside, and they also won't offer beard trims or facial waxes. We're ready to get back to doing what we love. Of course, your patience is welcomed as you get out there to these businesses. Remember, this too is new for them. Now, under phase two, also what will be reopening are breweries, wineries, and nail salons. Swimming pools can reopen too, but they need a permit. Things that will remain closed include bars, gyms or fitness centers, and indoor entertainment facilities. In South End, Hunter Signs, WCNC Charlotte.